artificial intelligence, hotly debated topic. Everyone's discussing it. You know, all the massive layoffs in the big public uh, tech sector uh, community that are happening appear to be related to AI. Like all the big companies are saying, we're letting 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 headcount go so that we can focus on AI and optimization and automation. So there's a lot of that going on. And there's a lot of opinions in economic circles and in tech circles about is AI good or bad? All right, I'm not going to get into that. You have to have, as an MSP, a position on AI. And I'll tell you what the position of the uh, quite a few MSPs that I've talked to, AI is probably unavoidable at this point. It's everywhere. It's going to be something that, that MSPs are going to have to take uh, into consideration. Number two, MSPs do not trust AI yet and may not for a very, very long time. MSPs don't trust AI enough to put AI technology directly up against their customer, which is to say that the MSPs want to keep AI tech back under the control of the MSP organization so that the customer isn't exposed potentially to a negative experience, whether that's a negative technical experience, a negative customer service experience. I think both are legitimate issues, but that's what the MSPs are telling us that they're very cautious about. They are using AI they're, they're really relying after and going after relationships with their vendors who have developed AI as back office automation and extensions, um, expansions of their team. Very common theme that we're hearing. But the MSPs are very cautious and saying, look, we're just not going to expose our customers directly to AI technology yet. Whatever your approach is going to be, you got to have one and you probably should have it articulated so that, you know, anyone in the company can really talk intelligently about it to your customers.